Psy2's fans have been waiting for the solar-powered emergency cell phone. Well, today, we finally delivered. In fact, we've created the do-it-yourself version, and it's only gonna cost you about 10 bucks. Do you own a cell or mobile phone? Most of you probably just said or thought yes. And I'm sure that at some point in your life, you've worried about losing charge at a very important time. Look, if you're into biking, hiking, camping, fishing, anything outdoors, you know the importance of having an emergency cell phone on you that's going to work no matter what. With the solar powered cell phone, you're gonna always be able to make that call, even if an electrical outlet isn't exactly in your immediate vicinity. Quite frankly, everybody should have one of these because you never know what's gonna happen. The first thing we need is a throwaway cell phone. You can get these super cheap now. Then, a cheap solar panel. Also, a blocking diode. You can get these at the electronics store. Now, solar panels come in different configurations and sizes. Mine happen to be mounted to a plastic sheet. So, I'm gonna trim that off and cut it down to the size of the phone itself. Cheap this simple enough. Just got out a basic cutting tool and smoothed out the plastic a little bit. When we're done, it's perfectly sized to the phone itself. So the next step is to attach it to the phone. I'm gonna use the back casing and hot glue it down. We'll place that on there and make it snug and secure. And now we're ready to move on to the next step. Using a soldering iron, I decided to cut some grooves into the plastic portion of the phone itself. This way, once we get some wiring in there, it's not going to prevent us from closing up the case. Also, it'll make sure the diode fits in there nicely. There's obviously better ways to do this, but if you want to be fast and cheap, just melt the plastic down. All right, we trimmed the diode, and now I'm gonna cut a few more grooves because we do have some major wiring to put in here. Okay, looks like we're set, the pathways are ready. First, I'm gonna solder the positive terminal of the solar panel into the diode itself. Basic diodes are gonna let electrical current pass in one single direction. It's called the diode's forward direction. There's a white line on the diode which indicates this direction. We want power to travel from the solar panel itself into the phone's battery. So we wire up the solar panel to the opposite end of the diode. Next, we wire the diode to the positive terminal on the phone's battery prongs. Final step is to run the negative cable from the solar panel into the negative battery prong. You can solder this or twist it, whatever you desire. All right, now we're gonna make sure we shove those wires into the grooves that we cut out earlier, pop in the real battery, and close up all the casing. And now, a quick test. Flip it around, turn it on, make sure it's still working. Excellent, looks like we've got juice. Now let's take it out into the sun and see if we can actually get a charge from it. Functionality on these phones is lacking. That's why they're so cheap. The only indicator I had that it was charging was a small beep. Listen for it. Look, different situations call for different gadgets. We're not saying to use this for your everyday mobile phone. In fact, that would be ridiculous. You don't want to walk around with a solar panel. So maybe you lost your phone, the battery ran out, you can't find a car charger, or perhaps you even forgot to charge it the night before. Whatever your personal reason is, the emergency solar phone gets you out of the jam. Now many of you may be asking, where can I get a solar panel? Well, the answer is very simple. Head over to your local electronics store or go online. The good news is solar panels have dropped in price by about 60% in the last two years alone. So you know what, you're sitting pretty. Solar keeps my emergency cell ready to go. To keep this show running, we've got Squarespace. Choosing a blog or publishing platform is a big decision that many people take far too lightly. Squarespace is a fully hosted platform with nothing to install and it's all updated with full stability. They've got brand new social widgets for Twitter, Flickr, even RSS feeds. And their platform makes it super simple for you to design your website today. Look, they've even got 24 hour support, so you're always gonna be taken care of. Anyway, go to squarespace.com science, put in the code at checkout, science9. You'll get two weeks free and 10% off any order you make. 
Now, like I said, we don't have room to store all the stuff we're making, so if you have an interest in getting your own emergency solar-powered cell phone, head over to facebook.com slash 2s and you know what? Leave a comment on the wall and let me know that you'd like to win it. We'll choose someone at random on next week's episode.